The previous game just really goes to show that the soldier deck just decided that, hey, I'm a long run deck, but I have no chance against this fella. So, time to push like crazy. I'm not completely against uh, pushing round one, but we would need a respectable deck. So cur currently we have Aretuzas with nothing to to use it on, other than Vizigota. Now we have something. So this is this is something that we can use, but also we this is pretty important to keep in mind. Well actually, she has only seven points worth of Dana. What you need to keep in mind is what your opponent's strategy is. And her strategy is the same as my strategy, long grand strategy. Easy. I don't have to think about this too much. I'm just gonna go with uh Sintrian Spellweaver. As you command. Yeah. Into Aratusa, into Reinforced Trebuchet. He might even play some smugglers here. And uh, he's gonna really want to keep that going. Actually, Vincent Mice should be interesting here. Gotta go with your gut. Kill that. We boost Vincent to make sure that we don't have an 8. He might go to... Nah, I think we're just gonna play three cards. He fucked up. Pushing too hard, so hard with no solid finisher. An ill wind. Hmm. Uh, we can just play a infrastructure here. Nice, 11 point down. Gonna get hit. But then he's gonna be at 7. And he needs to play quite a lot of points. It's possible that he needs to play two cards here. And if he does that, he's already locked into the long round three, which is sweet by me. Playing go on back row versus no realm. <laughs> yeah, he couldn't do it in one move, so he's committed to the long round three. The time of the white frost and white light. And apparently he's a good good hand because he just chose to throw away a seven. Anything in the, his hand is a uh, better than a seven. <laughs> he messed up. Thought I was near off guard. Uh. We're gonna need something to throw away. I suppose either one of these could work. I don't really wanna keep the Arthusa for later. He's never gonna push me. We've lived in isolation for too bloody long! I would be surprised if he plays anything here. Oh, oh Lady Margarita told us of this. <laughs> Lady Margarita. That's a Rooney. If he pushes here, I'll be very surprised. <laughs> but he played back row versus no realm. It happens. It happens to everybody. I have some good cards in the deck. That's uh, unquestionable. But that's a pretty good hand. Maybe we try to replace Willem for something. That's even better than the Kedvan Revenant. Okay, Queen Adalia. I'm just making sure that I haven't played one already. This is pretty good. I don't even mind starting here. We can start by playing a Lyrian Arbalest in the front. Although we can play a Windhelm of Atre, but it would be so good to kill stuff, right? It would be so satisfying. We can just delete everything. Think about that. Yeah, let's just delete everything. 
My great granddaughter will do great. We want to play the Lyrian Arbalest on the first row ASAP. Then we have those. We can just kill the Dryads. Well, that's basically it. Happens to rank 19 players. <laughs> what? We're playing at rank 3. I'm, I'm gone to now. Watch it. No! Let the doe live! I could kill those, that would be sweet. Ugh. I don't like this. Down the new cards. Lyrian Arbalest. Into even more Lyrian Arbalest. We kill one of those. Yeah, who cares about the Dryads? Hope he doesn't have a Gimpy though. Special prize, just for you, love. Uh, I kind of want to play my own value generator, but how could I when he has so much stuff? So if I play a Sheila, then I'm going to have 2 plus 5 damage. It's not good enough. It actually makes more sense to kill the Smuggler. Did it. Yeah, it makes more sense to maybe play a value generator here, like Visigota. Sometimes the price Boost this because it's the most vulnerable. Then kill the smuggler. Oh, let's go with that. So this way I have five point value generation on the board. I mean <laughs> seven turns to come. Oh that's so crushing. So do we shut that down? Or do I just go for my own value generation here? This could be really good. Yennefer could give us a lot of value. But this is guaranteed too. This is this could be even more. You crossed the wrong sorceress! Unfortunately we don't have a way to kill right now, but Yennefer should be pretty good. Oh, he killed an archer. What's in the background? Some some horses. Should be like green women. Oh no! Okay, we can get a good value here. I can lock, but maybe he has a boar. We can kill kill that with Sheila. Although it makes more sense to play Vinham of Atra. Down with the mirror. Oh, that's not good to seven. I mean uh, eight. I'll just wait. This would be actually a decent thing to play, I guess. But we probably want to play Bernard instead. Okay, that's annoying. So it's gonna block my Yennefer. How much I can do about it. Let's see if we can get out something spicy from the deck. Oh yeah, we're playing in the back. That's what matters. Oh uh, that that that's pretty good. Right. This cleaver should be a, a five, right? Although he probably should have played it if he has it already. Um. I can't really do too much with three. How much value generation I got? Two, four. That's kind of depends, but at least one. That's six, seven ish. Plus this guy. Feel dirty. A little, a little bit. A little bit. And go and ping me. Do I care about that? Not really. Play it now. Play it in the back. Better go in the roach. In the back. 
sure. Get him. I can get some extra dudes here. Actually, oh no, never mind that. Got ahead of myself. Just go with sevens. Hopefully, he doesn't have a squash. <laughs> He means Grave Dark Cleaver. It's called Sheldon. It's called Smash! Oh, great dope! That's actually pretty good. It wasn't tall enough to survive. Okay, uh... Well, there's not much to lock. I guess we can still lock Dryad. Maybe we're just gonna keep this. Maybe he has something uh, up his sleeve. I can just play the locker on the board and do nothing with it. I can ping that. Make sure we hit for more. Sheila. Sheila needs to be played a little bit. Not at the dead end. Not at the last play. Okay. Uh, let's just boost this a little bit. No, 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 no. I can kill stuff. Just like that. Game points. Oh, now it's time to play the boar. Soon I took his time. <laughs> yeah, that was a very strategic boar. It's like, maybe it's not time yet. Lock is played. That he probably doesn't have. Time to play my boar. But he wasn't too confident about this move. Like, he was, like, saving his best card for last, and he just, like, Check this out! And he runs away, like, screaming like a little girl. What the hell? But, okay, GG. He's reborn. Respect! Uh, we don't want to reinforce trebuchets. Is it gonna be one of those times that we, when we actually push round one? I don't know. Probably not. If we go second, it could be it. Beast and Mice is pretty good for that. Uh, let's just stop the like cavalry. The problem with monsters, when I'm against monsters, I very much suspect their win condition is always one thing. They always go for the, I got big dudes, uh, win condition. And that's it. And I can't blame them. That's all monsters have. And I think we have to keep that in mind. There are things and in the play of which like even that. The We're just gonna win friends. round one. Because the likelihood that this guy's gonna push me round two is roughly 100%. Apparently he really wanted this uh, horse dead. Adam, why you bad mouth your opponent? He obviously just got news that his $2 million investment got 120% uh, interest and ran uh, to his bank account to check it. He's a very rich and powerful man who just uh, left your, you, your victory to enjoy. Yeah. Actually, I feel a little bit better about it at times because when people show up, it's just a bit of a showmanship, honestly. I, I don't I think it's pretty harmless. And you guys like it, I like it. But sometimes the people show up who just fought against me and they, hey, what's up? Nice game. And I'm like, I'm I'm being a jerk, I guess. I wouldn't say that, I wouldn't act like that way, uh, in person. Uh well they also have a rocket screen, which is uh quite strong now. What you don't like is that I GG everyone. I can't please everybody, you see? GG's a privilege, not a right. No, no, no. Everyone deserves respect. Respect. Even the Skelliga. You heard it first. Even Skelliga deserves respect. I'm here to lend a help. 
something hot. So bad. Actually, we should have used the charge of this guy. <laughs> Who are you and where's the real Adam? <laughs> yeah, this guy is like ridiculously boring. I knew it. From the start. I got a lot of charges. Uh, we can get some Sabrina value. It can reset units, right? So I should be able to Vincent Mice. He's just gonna kill me, so we gotta be a little careful. I'm gonna save some charges. We gotta, we gotta be tricky here that we don't, don't actually lose this. That's pretty important. You start respecting Skelliga? No, 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 no. I don't respect Skelliga, but I pretend to. Very clear difference. You're losing him. Hmm. You gotta be tricky. Just like when the casters say on the tournaments, like, nice play. I wonder how this is gonna turn out. When you know it, one person is just gonna get completely annihilated. And you're just like looking forward to like 15 minutes of of uh you already know what's gonna happen. By the commanders, not by sorceresses. We're just gonna hit this guy. Overall, pretty good. Nine turn uh, long round three. Pretty sweet. Uh, we can make that work. Not the best cards uh, right now, but actually, we already got the magic mic played. But we probably want to play the Cadman Revenants. Hmm. Maybe maybe we're gonna double trebuchet. Not like that. Are you even talking like an Englishman? What? Skellig is uh, in a fun spot right now. No one is sure which leader is best. Many archetypes flying around with the same units. Okay. I guess I'm just gonna kick back a trebuchet and hopefully get something... Yeah, got some, some good cards in there. Not Kevin Revenant. Oh, that's bad. Is that completely useless? Not necessarily completely useless. We got uh, two chargers. Probably not gonna work out so well. We can start with a Vinhom Vatra. It looks invaders! like he's committed to playing on the front row. I don't have a lot of ways to ping units. Uh, If that doesn't die, uh, it's gonna be pretty helpful. But I don't think he has a way to kill it. Unless we have Parasite. Parasite can do it. I think he has Parasite. That's a really good card. You already got a homo chat? <laughs> what more you want? <laughs> no, the keyer is not a mod. You wanna be a mod? Oh, Gryo is not a mod too. God damn it, guys. Should, should everyone be a mod? Wait, what? 
Yeah, he's, he's not too dominant. He's not as dominant as he thinks he is. Yeah, let, I'm just gonna be the dominant one here. In some charges. We thought he was uh, the boss around here. He's not. Here ends up modding every channel on Twitch. Well, I wouldn't give this responsibility, this burden, but also honor to someone who doesn't want it. Okay, let's play. Yeah, now. Come on, man. Just boost her a little bit. So he, he obviously is playing around the trebuchet. Okay, time to play something big, apparently. Actually, what if we go like double trebuchet here? So I zap that. We play a trebuchet. Do I play another trebuchet? Let's just have the highest unit. Because, uh, screw him. I think we just gotta play another trebuchet. Oh! Get him. Oh, uh, that's fine. Alright. We can also play the Vernon Roche in the back. Wait, what? He had Proto Fleeter Feather all along and now he used it? Don't you think losing out on that free damage or free boost would have worked taking out my, my man? Alright, apparently not. I can lock something here. We can lock the Gunnature of Fruits. Or should I just get out some dudes? Getting out some dudes is probably the best. Mary, that's what matters. Oh, that's pretty good. Bad. Um. Okay. I don't see my graveyard now. I guess I still have gold cards. Not sure what though. Guess that. Punch him! Oh, some tall guy again. Guess it's about them time. Oh, we don't have anything to, to target with the charge now. Ah, uh, that's fine. I should be able to find the target for the Kedwin Revenant. Uh, and we're not gonna off this just yet. Get him, Revenant! Now you got a target! Look at this guy! He's points, immune points, points plus damage. Points plus damage, but he does a little, you know? It didn't work out for him. Maybe this card is bugged. Uh, points, points plus damage, points, points. Hi, guy points hmm. so we hit that actually we might just awk this not only let's get the revenant The Shilla on this guy, so then the Yankon, and uh, maybe we just don't do that and pass. Yep. It's giving up! I only had like 20 point value generation with the Noxus Oxfist coming up. 
Oh, this guy has no faith in just putting down seven points at a time. GG.